and YouTube family. It's your boy Dwight. Welcome back to the channel, Silverback Siage. Please, first off, do me a huge favor. Make sure you hit like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell icon so you can be notified when I post new content. Today, I plan to probe back off into a super duper popular fragrance house, and uh, it's many flankers. If you'd like to find out exactly what house that is, keep it locked. Well, let's get right off into it. Today, I plan to probe back off into the house of Dior, and to be, to be specific, the house of Dior Sauvage and its many flankers. Let's start with the box presentation for Dior Sauvage Toilet. On the back of your box, you got a bunch of product information. I don't know if you can see that, it's kind of small. On the bottom, batch code and product information also. Let's get her out of here, see what we got. Here's your bottle presentation. Got your Dior symbol on the top. Dior engraved in the bottom. Now all of these come with this super neat magnetic cap. I love that. And in the lid, which is very hard to see, there's a signature bumblebee on the inside, but you probably can't hardly see that. Let's give her a spray. And break it down a tad bit. All right. This one here was launched in 2015. It is an aromatic fougere that took the fragrance world by storm. Top notes. Bergamot and pepper. Mid notes, you got another type of pepper, lavender, pink pepper, vetiver, patchouli, geranium, to name a few. And then your base notes, you got ambroxan, cedar, and lavender. Now, in this fragrance right off the bat, you get pepper, 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 and when in doubt, more pepper. It's a very, very strong peppery scent, but as it begins to dry down, you get that lavender peeking in there, and you also get some of that, well, no, nah, I ain't gonna say some of that. This is an ambroxan bomb. So this is a very, very loud fragrance. So this is one that you wanna definitely watch your sprays. If you're gonna wear this to work, for example, especially if you work in cubicles or an enclosed area, two, three sprays, tops. Now, if you're out where the air's flowing pretty good and you actually wanna make your presence known somewhere else, you can spray it a little bit more than that, but you don't have to go crazy on the sprays for this one because it performs excellent. Now, on my skin, it performs about eight hours. If I put it in my clothes, I get about 10 hours out of it. Your complement factor for this fragrance is extremely high, unless somebody's actually tired of smelling it because it's a fragrance that a lot of people actually have in their collection, even if they're not collectors. They've heard of this one, bought this one, plus they got Johnny Depp on the commercials making it a super cool and attractive commercial just to get you to the store so you'll go ahead and buy this one. Price-wise, this 100 mil bottle in your Macy's and your dealers will cost you about 100 bucks. I don't know if you can find it too much cheaper on discounters because most of the time, Dior's products, along with Chanel, kind of hold their value as far as what the price point is so they don't get much of a discount. If I had to rate this toilet out of the it and its many flankers, I rated a strong 9.5. I like it a whole bunch. This is one that I love to wear, whether it's fresh out the shower, out in public, to work on occasion, because it's a super fresh scent and it's mass appealing. My conclusion overall for this fragrance, I would have to say this is definitely a must try, but as far as my taste buds when it comes to fragrance, it's a must have. It's one that I feel that I will always have a bottle, and the next time that I plan to buy this one, I probably will look into discounters and buy the 200 mil bottle, so it lasts me for a long, long, long time. But other than that, oh, by the way, if you have this in your collection, let me know what you think of it, how long you've had it, 
And uh, if you haven't never smelled it, I recommend that you get your nose on it. That's my time. Peace.